afternoon everybody, my name is Katrin and you're watching a video on KISS, Key to It Simple for Success. Today we're going to have a little chat just through some of the things that I bought on my shopping trip today. Um, it's Sunday and Sunday is a shopping day for me and it's also the day where I put together um, some of my meals for the week. Um, one of my top tips is to be prepared, so here are some of the things that I, that I grabbed from the shop today. So we'll start off with some of the meat. Um, this week I'm going to be doing a um, Thai green curry with coconut milk and, and coconut oil. So because there's quite a high fat sauce to go with this, I've got some um, chicken mini fillets which I'm going to be putting in the curry. Next thing then guys, we've got some pork belly slices. This is going to be for my meal preparation. This here is for my lunches for the week. I'm going to be slow roasting these pork belly slices which are lovely high in natural fat and they're going to keep me going for lunch in work. So later on today I'll be posting a video going through how we, I've meal prepped for the week. Okay, moving forward then, small bit of cooked ham, believe it or not this is not for me, this is for my husband. Um, he's not a ketogenic eater, um, regardless of what I say, um, but this is his ham, not mine. If it was my ham it would need more fat on it for me. Um, moving forward then, again, more pork. Pork I find really, really versatile. So I've got some pork loin steaks and they'll be great for, for an evening uh, dinner when I get home from work and everyone in the family likes these pork loin steaks. So we've got some of them. Um, I also bought some corned beef. Um, corned beef is nice and high in fat um, and it's really, really cheap and it's great for all sorts of different meals. Um, even just fried up on its own with some fried eggs and butter, that sort of thing. It's really, really handy to have in the cupboard. It doesn't go off. Um, so when I remember to buy some, I always come home with some corned beef for the cupboard. Last but not least then, um, got some bacon. Um, if you can see, it's a really good high fat content bacon here. So this will be for, for breakfast, but also for all sorts of meals through the week as well. You can add it to so many things. It's really, really versatile. Um, and if you can just get hold of a, a nice big pack of, of bacon, then you're gonna be off to a good start for the week. So that's the, the meat that I've picked up today. Some of the dairy then, well, no ketogenic lifestyle um, is, is complete without salted butter. If you don't eat dairy, then obviously you can use things like coconut oil or things like that. But we do eat dairy in this house with, without any issue. Um, and so for me, a nice um, grass-fed salted butter. We're very lucky in the UK that all our butter is grass-fed. Um, so we can just buy any old cheap butter in Aldi and that's great. Got some um, nice mature cheddar. Adds great flavour, good salt content in here as well. Um, and it's a really easy way to add fat to, to meals is to grate some cheese on it or to add some cheese. So always cheese on the list. Got some double cream. Um, our Kiss Coffee has double cream in it only because it tastes absolutely superb. In uh, the US this is called heavy cream or heavy whipping cream. Um, so do your best to, to find some really good natural um, high fat cream because for your coffees and for sauces and things like that and for adding fat, um, that can be really helpful. Um, got some eggs here. Um, as you're aware, eggs fantastic for both fat and protein, really versatile. Lots and lots of meals that you can make with eggs and you can just add an egg to, to any of your meals as well if you're feeling hungry to keep hunger at bay, they're really, really good. Um, lastly then, I have some veg already in the house, so it wasn't a massive veggie shop today. Um, however, I picked up some baby leaf salad. Um, I love all sorts of greens and if you follow in the plan you'll understand that greens is important for your potassium, for your magnesium um, and for all those vitamins and minerals that, that the body needs to stay healthy. I've got some broccoli. Broccoli is great. It's actually one of the highest protein um, vegetables so you're not just getting all the green stuff from your broccoli but you, it'll also keep you fuller um, and give you some protein too. Now I normally buy green peppers, but they didn't have any today on their own, and I only needed one. So I have got a red pepper today. Now, they're really, although there's more carbs in this red, red pepper, bell pepper, or capsicum, or whatever you call it in your country, um, 
to be honest, there's only one, and that's to, to go between quite a you know a couple of people as well. So the carb content of, of swapping between green and red peppers is really negligible. So not worried about that whatsoever. Lastly, then is onions. Um, now in week one of the plan, you won't see any onions, and the reason is that an onion is is actually quite high in carbs. Um, but going forward, once you're in uh, ketosis, it's quite safe to start adding small amounts of onion back into your food. And as you'll know, onion is fantastic for flavour and is in quite a few recipes. So again, this is something that I don't eat several onions a day. However, I do put some onion in, in my food because I love the flavour and it, and it really does in, enrich um, the dishes that I make. So that's it that's what i bought in aldi today like i said there's there's other things that i already have in the cupboard you'll see that i have my pink salt i've got my coconut oil there's lots of things that i have already so i haven't had to buy um, however that's what i bought today um, and if you've got any questions at all about the video then do put them in the comments i'd love you to um bring your friends into the group the, the group is completely free to the public. It's here to educate um, and inform people about the ketogenic lifestyle. Um, as you can see, I'm, I'm happily at my goal weight now and I want you lot to all feel what I feel, which is free from hunger, free from food cravings and able to manage my weight how I see fit. Um, so I really hope you bring other people in and uh, enjoy the, the, the videos and all the information that I provide. Anyway, I'm not exactly TV presenter of the year, so I'm going to leave you now, um, but again, hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.